Hello guys and welcome to Mark Shrimp Tanks. Today we're doing shrimp versus broccoli. Alright guys, so I really don't know anything about uh, broccoli apart from it tastes really good. And this is what we're going to use today in the shrimp tank. We're going to put in some broccoli, right? So this whole piece is going to go in here, I'm kidding. Uh, the wife is going to boil this or steam it, I think. And I'll be right so back. this we'll is the broccoli. The and it's going to be cooked for 34 minutes. Let's see. Oh, camera's all steamed up. Great job. Let's see. A wee windscreen wiper. Oh, it's steamed up again. So this is okay, cooked so for we three, have four minutes. Our little right? piece of uh, broccoli here. It's been nicely cooked. It was um, gently boiled for three to five minute, minutes, so I've been told. So. Let's just separate this up a little bit. We're going to put, try and put a little bit in every tank today. Um, and the way we're going to do this, guys, as well, is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to let you choose at the end of the video if you thought it was successful or not, right? And the way you're going to do that, guys, is you're going to go over and hit that like or dislike button. If you thought it was crap, wasting time doing this, then hit that dislike button. If you thought the shrimp enjoyed it and you would try it at home, Hit that like button. Right, so we have uh, split this up into quite a few pieces. And by the way guys, I love broccoli as well. It's like, mm. you know when you're a kid you hate stuff like this and then when you're older you seem to appreciate things like this a little bit more. Right, so this is unseasoned, this was just boiled as it was. The wife, I think she put seasoning in it after. Let's see, get a good picture of it. Right to the left, right, and then we're going to go over to each tank. Here we we're going to put it in. Let's go to the first tank here, hopefully you, you guys are going to be able to see this because it's a little bit awkward with me having you guys on my chest all the time. So let's see, we'll put this in, sink or float, sink or float, sink or float, tell me now. You bet, oh my god, it's wanting to... Ah, uh, it's like, I don't know, maybe it's got air trap now, let's give it a little bit of shake. Uh, sink, yeah, uh, it will sink eventually, it's very in the middle. Right, so let's put in a piece in every tank. And uh, obviously tanks that don't have so many shrimp, I'm not going to put as many in. Right, so, let me just get the bigger tanks out of the way first, because I don't want to put huge bits in, and then they don't sink, because that would be kind of a crap video. Let me see, so up we go, give it a shake, maybe the, it has air trap. Now this part is sinking, so at least we'll get something on camera, maybe it was that one part. Into the food dish. Right, and... It's got a part in there. It's probably all it is, guys, is a bit like air trapped in it from when it was cooked. Tiny bit in here. Tiny, tiny bits in other ones. Don't want the dug wheat. Dug, the dug wheat. Dug, duck, duck wheat. I'm not going to put it in all the tanks just because there's not that much left. And it's sinking. Most of it is sinking, so, you know, I should probably should have put a big piece in this bit here. Which I might do, actually. I might. I might just take it out of this tank here because there's not so many shrimp in here. There's a lot of algae. Well, just as I'm taking it out, there's a little blue bolt on there. Let's take this out here. Right, so remember guys, at the end of the video you're going to see some music by Kyla Minogue. Probably not. And then I want you guys to tell me how you felt about the food, okay? Okay. <laughs> 